Jackson. He's our Capital One player so now. tonight. 449 yards of total offense and four touchdowns. The freshman. One timeout remaining. Louisville has the ball now. Texas a and needs to stop Louisville here. That young man played a quarterback and won a lot of football games. And his eighth start of the season tonight. The underdogs. And he will be stacked. It'll bring up third down. Historic night for Lamar Jackson tonight. Relative to the time, last time out taken by Texas A&M. Yards passing and rushing in a bowl game. He joins Johnny Manziel and Vince Young. That is it. Louisville on third down now. Two pretty good ones to have your name associated with. And this is serious now. No timeouts left for Texas A&M. Three timeouts left for Louisville. Third and three. Louis, Texas a and must stop Louisville here, or else I'm afraid this game is going to be over. And they are. Get him on the edges where one he can pick up the, the first down himself by running, or he extends the play, chews up some clock. Uh. And they're going the football. They'll probably take a delay a game penalty to, to run it down even more, and then punt and play defense if he doesn't pick it up with this on this third down in this third down situation. Third and three. Here we go. Third and three now. Louisville. He's got it. He's got the edge. Jackson has a first down. That'll do it. That will do it. As Louisville takes the win, as now they will kneel it here. That allows Lamar Jackson to pick it up, pick up the first down with ease. It was Claude George who was trying to close from inside out to stop it. Yep, and this is victory formation for Six Louisville. Six 100 yard rush games this season for Lamar Jackson. And the latest, the greatest. A career high, 226 yards on just 22 carries. And through the air, 227 yards on only 12 completions. Louisville will close the season having won six of its last seven games. After an only three start, the worst start since 1984. They finish with a flourish. And if you want to go ahead and buy a preview magazine for next season, Louisville's going to be towards the top of the rank. Yeah, no doubt about it. He's going to be on a lot of covers of magazines going into 2016, and rightfully so. We got a chance to see him on tape before this game, and it was as good as advertised. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Zero. Louisville goes to eight and five. Texas A&M goes to eight and five.